Uh, my bangs are not going to be clipped back, so I'm just going to kind of clip them to the side. They're probably not going to stay and they're going to look all funny, but okay. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to take my braid and I'm going to clip. I'm going to do one at a time because my hair is a little different. So I clipped it right here. So just as many as it takes for you to flip it down. Okay, and now the second braid. It's gonna be down here. All right, so my braid are crossing over and I'm going to clip that part right there and right at the crossing point. So I have them crossing each other. You're going to want to fix these alright. Okay. So as you can see they're crossing over alright. So then you're going to want to clip all these little excess hairs down So do that now. You can even spray it down a little bit. So they kind of go down. Because I know it's kind of hard. At least for curly hair. It's probably hard for all hair. But it's really hard for curly hair. Alright. So I have that one down. I'm going to spray this one. Just move it with your hand. Whoops. And you're gonna just like and flip down. So now they're clipped down. Now you have those. Um, for your bangs, I'm gonna say cut like um, part them in kind of a diagonal way. All right, and then use a bit of spray. As you can see, spray is the only thing you'll need um, in this product. All right. So now what you're going to do is you're going to twist in. Yeah. Twist in all the way. Make sure no hairs are sticking up. So twist all the way. And when hairs start sticking up, spray it. Okay. And then you're going to clip it right here. But if you guys wanted the poof, you'll have the other poof, all right? And then we're gonna spray this side a little bit. Usually the smaller ones are the hardest to actually do, so you're just gonna twist inward. This is not gonna have that much of an effect as the other one does, but it still shows. And you'll get this little twist in the front and then the side, so it's kind of like diagonal and everything. So you can have all your hair down, like I was saying. Um, so you can have your hair down or all of your hair up. But right now, um, I parted the hair in two because I'm going to have half up, half down. So the hair that's going up, I did not tie. I put all the hair that's going down, I tied it together. So you have that on the side. All right. Um, this part, what you're going to do is you're going to go take your hand like this, put your hair, pull it, and hold it. So you're just going to hold it like that. And then you're going to take your scrunchie. Alright, so hair. Have your scrunchie ready on your hand like this. So when you take your scrunchie, you just pull and it automatically kind of goes in like this. So then you pull as much as you want and then you just twist it. So you're going to have this little bun thing right here. Just squeeze it and then let your hair 
kind of go, you can push it down to fix it. All right, so that is what this part looks like. Again, just do that little bow thing how I showed you. And then you're gonna let all your hair down loose. And then you can put gel on your hair or not. I left it kind of frizzy, just for more of a natural look. All right, and that is my hair. So you have your braids, your little twisties, and then you have your hair down yet up at the same time. All right, guys? So if you guys have any more questions about this hair, let me know, just comment below. Also, let me know what you think. I hope you guys enjoyed this. This is a great summer look. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Bye, guys.